is urging iPhone and iPad owners to update their operating systems immediately after discovering a vulnerability that hackers may already be exploiting. The powerful new spyware is able to hack Apple products without end user interactions, meaning a hacker can get into your device without you having had done anything. Apple is urging iPhone and iPad owners to update their operating systems immediately after discovering a vulnerability that hackers may already be exploiting. The powerful new spyware is able to hack Apple products without end user interactions, meaning a hacker can get into your device without you having had done anything. Apple is urging iPhone and iPad owners to update their operating system. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, family. You know, uh, for all of you iPhone users out there, if that ain't the craziest thing, I think that that is something that should cause you great concern. That somebody can stand next to you if you haven't updated your software and just download everything you have on your iPhone. So they said several police departments in Massachusetts are sharing a warning for parents about the new Apple software update. Police in Digton and Andover are among those issuing a warning on social media following the recent operating system 17 software release, iOS. If you have an iPhone and have not done the recent Apple iOS 17 update, they have set a new feature called Name Drop defaulted to on. This feature allows the sharing of your contact info just by bringing your phones close together, police posted. The department suggested parents turn this default off by going into the settings, then general. From there, you can select airdrop, then bring in vices together, and then toggle it to off. Police suggested parents change the settings on their chi uh, child's phone, iPads, and other Apple uh, devices immediately. Tech and cybersecurity expert Alan Crow has told uh, CBS Philadelphia the feature can be especially dangerous for children. If a stranger walks by your child and gets their contact information, um, they, they have their sm email, and we've seen how now how the bad guys and pedophiles and whatnot really take advantage of the email. You know, phone number for texting. They really take advantage of that stuff. And God forbid they decide to use the home address or visit or even stalk. That's even deeper. So from a cybersecurity point, this is a major, major red flag. Now, I don't know about y'all. I don't have an iPhone, but for those of y'all who do, let me know if that is a point of contention, a concern for you. Or if, you know, if it's all good and all things are, you know, a go. And that's just um, something that you feel that they just saying. I myself, I personally, I, would, I, I wouldn't trust it. I would be like, let me fix this right away. Because I wouldn't want it a risk somebody having all of my information um so i don't know tell me what you think okay like what you hear like subscribe and share the channel and i'll see you in the next video bye bye